This is your ESPN Alamogordo Tiger Athlete of the Week Spotlight, brought to you by Vision Ford Lincoln Hyundai and Premium Pre-Owned Vehicles, the Winter Circle, and NMSUA. This week's athlete is Adriana Chenault of Lady Tiger Basketball. The uh, knockoff Las Cruces, number five team in the state. How big was that for you and, and your teammates last night? I think this is the biggest win that Lady Tiger Basketball has had in four years. Like this, Beating Las Cruces says a lot because now like we have the confidence going into Clovis, Hobbs, and Carlsbad. Maybe that's what we needed is that mental step. Like, hey, we can play with these teams. And beating Cruces just gave us that confidence. Your improvement playing basketball, I mean, I, I think we both say soccer is probably more your sport, but Coach has shown a lot of faith in you to go out there and play. How do you feel like your game has progressed this season? I think overall my game has progressed like through my shot because I've been working like on the off season, like every day putting up hundreds of shots, just shot after shot. The, the one thing that you provide maybe more than anything else is you're you're an energy person out there. Oh, yeah. would, that, would that be a <laughs> yeah. fair way to describe yourself? <laughs> yeah. Whether you're, you're starting the game or you're coming off the bench, is that one thing that coach looks for you to do if he, if he needs the energy level to come up that you can provide that for the team? Yeah, he's always told me like, Audrey, if anything else, like we look to you as an energy person. Like if, you know, the other players aren't providing the energy we need like we throw you in there and yeah like you make mistakes but like you hustle back you know and you always try to like motivate your play your teammates i, I do want to talk about soccer a little bit because that's what you're going to continue playing uh coming up in college <laughs> uh you're going to university of southwest and hobbs right mm -hmm. but you've also got something really cool coming up tell us a little bit about the the usa soccer opportunity that uh, that you've got coming up well really i just got an invitation it's like hey we've selected you you know come play in europe and at first i was like well i don't know if this is real if this is like a general letter they send out to kids yeah. but we looked into it and it was legit and it's crazy like 15 to 16 girls get selected for the team and you know I go over there and play against other countries and it's a cool opportunity but if people want to help contribute to you being able to to compete there uh, they can go to gofundme.com and then just type in Adriana Chenault and yeah. it'll, it'll get, get them there right <laughs> yeah. and I'm sure you'll appreciate any support that you can get from the community right I appreciate anything like even if you can't donate just you know, having the support coming out to me and saying, hey, congratulations on this. Like, it means a lot knowing people know. I know you don't, probably don't want to think about it too much, but <laughs> what, what do you think you're going to remember the most about, you know, just playing sports at AHS because you've been involved in, in multiple sports for a number of years now? The thing that I'm going to remember most is my teammates, definitely. You know, the bond that you create with these girls, like, it's more than just wins and losses, really. It's more than just, like, beating cruises. Like, it's a big thing, but really it's a bond that you have with these teammates. School-wise, do you know what uh, you want to get into in terms of uh, your study? Studies in college or still working that one out? I'm going to study um, kinesiology okay. and get my master's there at Southwest. Hopefully go to Phoenix or Tucson. And Congratulations on being athlete of the week and uh, best of luck the rest of the season. Thank you so much.